snakes as we know them have been on Earth for about 145 million to 65 million years. Snakes probably came from the Mediterranean Tethys, a strip of water that was there when the continents were moving. Some people think snakes came from the water, while others think land snakes evolved on land. This means that there must be some pretty cool fossils of snakes from the past. Even though fossil records aren't very good, there are some ancient snakes that are worth a closer look. Here are the seven of the longest prehistoric snakes that have ever been found. Number 7. Sanija Sanija is a genus of late Cretaceous snake from western India. Sanija was around 11.5 feet in length based on the length of the skull. A recently described fossil from the Lamida Formation has been found coiled around the neck and an adjacent skeleton of a 50 cm long sauropod dinosaur hatchling. This ancient snake lurked in dinosaur nesting grounds in order to gobble up hatchlings as they emerged from eggs. Fossils from Western India suggest. Number 6. Mad Soya Before the KT extinction 65 million years ago, Mad Soya probably hunted small dinosaurs and possibly also small mammals when young. The size of the snake is uncertain due to incomplete remains, but with the vertebra indicates a large size at least 16 feet long. After the extinction, Mad Soya would have had to focus on the newly evolving mammals, birds and probably other reptiles like crocodiles, a precedent which has been observed in the modern world. Number 5. Wanambi this snake died out 50,000 years ago. At 16 to 20 feet long and from Australia, Wanambi could have taken on any small to medium-sized animal. Wanambi was a constrictor, which means it didn't use any poison to kill its prey. Instead, it wrapped itself around its prey and squeezed it so tight that its prey couldn't breathe. Another idea though is that cardiac arrest is caused by the pressure of the snake on the chest. No matter how the prey dies, death comes quickly. And if you've ever been caught by a big python, you know there's not much you can do to get out of its grip. Number 4. Your Lunger This is another member of the same group of ancient snakes as Wanambi. The estimated length of the snake was at least 20 feet long. Your Lunger was also a constrictor, which means it wrapped itself around its food and killed it by squeezing it. One thing that sets your lunger apart from other snakes in its family is that it has what may be one of the best preserved heads ever found. This skull came from an area with fresh water, which suggests that your lunger may have waited for its food in the water. Number 3. Paleophys About 33 million years ago, Paleophys went extinct. It was the biggest sea snake that ever lived. It may have been as long as 30 feet and it may have eaten animals as big as whale babies. It is thought that the high sea temperatures, which helped the snake grow, made it possible for it to get so big. Snakes are cold-blooded, which means that they react to the temperature of their surroundings. When it's hot, they move around more. When it's cool, they sleep. Number 2 on the list, Gigantophis. For over a hundred years, Gigantophis was regarded as the largest known snake. Gigantophis was a prehistoric snake, which may have measured more than 33 feet, larger than any living species of snake. The species is known only from a small number of fossils, mostly vertebrae. It was back in 1901 that Charles W. Andrews, a British paleontologist, first published the discovery of this enormous snake and described the gigantophis from the fossils and skeletal remains that was unearthed in eastern Egypt. And number 1. Titanoboa The Titanoboa is the world's largest snake. In the world's first tropical jungle, Titanoboa was the most dangerous animal. The snake was thought to be up to 50 feet long and 3 feet wide, and it was thought to weigh about 1.25 tons. This snake lived between 58 and 60 million years ago, after the dinosaurs died out. Scientists aren't quite sure how it went extinct, but they believe that climate change had something to do with it.
In 2009, some fossils were found in a coal mine in La Guaida, Colombia. And with that, we have come to the end of this video. Comment down your thoughts on what videos you want to see next. We will see you positively in the next one. Take care.